service here for our, our Hillcrest online communion service. I'd like to invite you to the table of the Lord this morning. It's not the church's table, but it's God's table, and it's been made ready for those who love God, and those who want to love God more. So come, you who have much faith and you who feel you have little, you who have been here often and you who have not been here for a long time, you who have tried to follow and you who have failed, come. Not just because it's me inviting you, but it's God's that is inviting you. And it's his will that if you want to meet with him, this is the time, this is the place. So when we take communion, we take the bread and the cup, we're reminding ourselves of the covenant love and the covenant promises of our God. And so I want to put into practice uh, what we learned today in our teachings from the end of Psalm 91. And I want you to repeat after me before we take the bread. I want you to repeat after me the I wills that God has for us. And so I'm going to use my name, but you should probably use your own name. And uh, we're going to repeat this, and we're going to make this our confession, and then we'll take and eat the bread. Please repeat after me. Because Andrew loves me, says the Lord, I will rescue Andrew. I will protect Andrew, for he acknowledges my name. Andrew will call on me, and I will answer 
Andrew. Personalizing that. You, God wills that for you. Why don't we take our bread? If you have one of these, you can take your little wafer and let's eat this together in remembrance of what Christ has done for us. Amen. Please repeat after me the second part of the end of Psalm 91. I will be with Andrew in trouble. I will deliver Andrew. And I will honor Andrew. With long life, I will satisfy Andrew. I will show Andrew my salvation. In the same way also he took the cup after supper, saying, this cup is the new covenant in my blood. Do this as often as you drink it in remembrance of me. For as often as you eat this bread and drink the cup, you proclaim the Lord's death until he comes again. Take the drink that you have prepared and let us remember that this is God's will for us. Amen. Thank you for joining us for this uh, little time of, communi- of communion and ask that the Lord bless you and keep you and cause his face to shine upon you and give you his joy, his peace, and his comfort. We'll see you next week. God bless.